I was, uh, I was very, very worried. They told me that they're going to make an arrangement for me to go and see the crime prevention officer. They go out and put locks on the windows. <laughs> I ha I'm sorry, I have to laugh at that. I mean, Northumbria police, I mean, must, must not be in touch with the situation here. Um, Martin McGarland would be one of the IRA's main targets. The government does not agree, though the position argued by their lawyers is confusing. On the one hand, they concede there is a threat against him, but they also say it is not such that he needs to move immediately. He's been offered a new identity, but is still in the same house. They reject any suggestion that Mr McGartland has been treated unreasonably and remain committed to providing the appropriate support. The government have now offered what it considers to be that appropriate support, £3,000 to move out. But Martin McGartland says this will hardly compensate him for the amount he's invested in his home, and who'd buy a house from an IRA target anyway? But he hopes to move on before the IRA move in.